Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Warhammer 40k Armageddon. Uh, in well, it's actually been uh, about a week, uh, a little bit more than that, actually, uh, since the last recording session. So I've kind of forgot where we were. Uh, if I recall correctly, um, our last mission we had to kill Thraka's gun wagon, or at least his. Uh, he had like a, a big unit, a kill cruiser or something. Uh, on for or no battle fortress, that's what it was. Um, and he wasn't on it, and we're, uh, relieving a hive, uh, from Orc Siege. Uh, but he wasn't on it, and now he's counterattacking, and we have to, uh, now, we have to, uh, if I recall, capture all six victory hexes and destroy Thraka's unit. So we have to try and kill him again. Uh, there's one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So we, we control the majority of the of the uh, victory hexes right now, though by the looks of it, we won't for a while, because down south here they are getting wrecked. Uh, so that's a thing. Okay. Now we have uh, <clears throat> we have uh, Reaver Battle Titans here, so that's good. Uh, but we did take Pretty heavy losses in the last one, from the looks of it. Uh, I can't really remember, but I'm pretty sure we took some losses, because I'm missing a lot of units here. So, let's go ahead and purchase. If I recall as well, they did say there's new units to buy, so let's take a look. Alright, looking at here... Hmm... Anything new from the guard? Ooh... Ooh. Let's see, anything new, anything new... I think the sh I think the Shadow Sword got some upgrades. Storm Lord got some upgrades as well, I think. And the Storm Sword got some upgrades. And the Bane Sword. And the Storm Blade. So a lot of Bane Blades got upgrades, it looks like. Hmm. Artillery. Same old, same old. Aircraft, same. Oh, ho, 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 Oh no. Mega Bolter. <clears throat> Let's see here. Inferno Gun, Turbo Laser Destructor, Inferno Gun, and Plasma Blast Gun. We're gonna go with a basic... Yeah, we're gonna go with a basic Warhound Scout Titan. And pick that up. Oh, wow. That's a thing of beauty. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, we're also going to pick up a unit of Oakland Squad veterans, because we don't have them anymore, if I double-check our roster here. Yeah, we lost those guys, uh, which kind of sucks, but whatever. So, purchase those. Okay, we've got those. We need some tanks, because we are out of tanks. Ooh, Sanguinian Guard? Oh, those look so good. Those look really good. Ooh, Thunderfire Cannons. I don't know what a th I realized I don't know what a Thunderfire is. I don't think this was in the game uh, when I was playing it last. Or if it was, it was very rare. Huh. Let's see here. Ooh, we got some new... So, they had the Hellfire in that, so now there's the Ironclad. So, it looks like just a... Yeah, it looks like just a close combat. And a Furioso, which is another close combat. Okay, that makes sense. Vehicles... About the same... Tanks, Crusader, oh, yep, we got some new, we got an upgraded Vindicator, might be worthwhile, uh, got a couple upgraded Predators, hmm, and let's see here, we got Land Raider with Hyperion, so that's, uh, missile launchers, Prometheus, which is just heavy bolters and storm bolters, and the Redeemer has Assault Cannons, Flamethrowers, or Flamestorm Cannons, and Storm Bolter. Hmm. Huh. That's interesting. Interesting. Alright, and see what the Ultramarines got. What have they got? Uh, Centurions. Ooh. Oh, they got Centurions? Centur- were Centurions- well, Centurions weren't a thing back in the, uh, uh, the, uh, uh, second Ar uh, War of Armageddon. 
Uh, I'm sensing. I'm sensing a, a, a weird, twisted version of Codex creep. Uh, okay. Tanks. Anything new with these guys? It doesn't look like anything special. And they don't get anything special up here either. Okay, so it's basically the same stuff. Um, well, I think we need a unit. Well, I'm just, uh, I don't want to lose a lot of units here, so we gotta, we gotta look through this. We gotta, we gotta scout Titan, plus two Reavers, so that'll work out pretty well. We got four pieces of artillery, we got the Land Raider, one Sentinel, let's pick up another Sentinel. Actually, you know what? No. No. If they keep dying, we're not gonna pick them up again. I'm gonna, st I'm gonna get out of that habit. Okay, we got a lot of Marine infantry, so we got de Devastator squads, two, uh, Blood Angel tactical squads, a, uh, Blood Angel Terminator Squad with Assault Cannon. And we have uh, Captain Tycho, who's still alive. Good. Um, let's pick up... Uh, let's see here. I know this is slow, but this is important. Let's pick up... a tank or two. When I'm thinking... Oh, what was the anti-Titan? What was the Titan Killer? Oh, it's Quake Cannon? No. No, not the Quake Cannon. Plasma Blast? No, it wasn't the Plasma Blast Gun. It was the uh, Laser Demolisher or something? Hellhammer Cannon. Oof. Oof. Oh, that is... Hmm. Shadow Sword? Volcano Cannon. Ooh. Yeah, I think this was it. Volcano Cannon for last gun. Oh, yeah. So we get the heavy bolters on top of that. It's a thousand. Yeah, that could be worth it. Pick that up. That gives us a really good anti-armor. Yeah, we're going to do that. So there we go. We got a couple of super heavies on the field for us. And now we need... I'm going to pick up... Yeah, I think it's good. We're going to pick up a Lehman Rust Vanquisher Cannon. We're just gonna like, rain down hell on them from afar. And then, what else do we need? We can pick up infantry for the Marines. Pick up infantry for the Marines, so what do we need? We need... Graviton gun. What the hell's a Graviton gun? I feel, I feel really out of the loop when it comes to some of these units. Pick up an upgraded Rhino while we're at it with it. I don't know. Pick it up. Uh, let's not show favoritism to one chapter or the other. Uh, Vanguard veterans? Do we have any assault marines left? Or did they all die? They all died. So, we'll pick up a Vanguard veterans with a Rhino upgrade. Okay, we've got one more unit. One more unit. Do we have on? Do we have a dreadnought? We do not have a dreadnought. Oh yeah, he died. Uh, so which dreadnought do we want? I'm thinking power fist, venerable dreadnought, assault cannon, and powered fist. Or power fist, not powered. Uh, yeah, we'll pick up a venerable dreadnought. Uh, an ultramarine's venerable dreadnought. So there we go. We're using a pretty equal mix. Most of our heavy ar artillery is coming from uh, from the guard, uh, in literal or also figuratively, and we're also using some of our uh, staple units here. So okay, now it's time to deploy them. <laughs> um, I think uh, we saw gargants down here because it's basically just an expanded map from the last one. So we saw gargants along these trench lines. So I'm gonna put the Warhound down there, and I'm going to put the potential Titan Killer uh, Super Heavy up here just to help us out. And then the Vanquisher is going to go right there with the Sentinel to scout for him. Uh, let's put the Land Raider over here. Okay, and the artillery is going to be kind of clustered around here. All right, now we have our infantry. So get our heavy guys right there. Tycho in the front. Uh, guardsmen, 
get inside of some stable, well, co good cover positions. Ogrens up front. Then we get some of our boys, well, our, our battle brothers around here. I'll have you come up there with one support squad. And let's see, who's the light? Who's the light? Your light. Okay. All right, I think that looks good. Yeah, I think that looks good. We're gonna save here, because that took a long time. So we're just gonna save that right there. Yes, overwrite. Okay. Okay, and end deployment. Orcs turn one. Where are you coming from, you little bastards? Let's click off up here. Again, it's basically just militia. That's not good. These guys got to hold out. Well, they do have the hive turrets, so that might help them. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to come down here and support them with a detachment. Oh. Oh, yeah, they're gone. It's just heavy bolters on a turret. It doesn't. It's not going to save them. At least these guys are in defensible positions. Oof. Oh yeah, we're needed everywhere. I could send a Titan to the. No, they need to be supported. If they get caught out by themselves. Titans are going to die. That's artillery, that's not good. It's more artillery, yep. Wonder if Yara could come and help us. It'd be nice. Okay, hive turret. Just kill off. At least hit that. And then you don't have a shot, damn it. take a hit on those guys. Okay, yeah, we'll uh, we'll save the rest for later. Let's figure out what we got going for us. Okay, we got something down here. Could send this detachment down south. We could send uh, the spawned-in units up here to help with some of our support units as uh, extra help. Let's get the Reavers up here. Nothing. Okay, nothing from the Reavers so far. They've got Zip in front of them. Terminator's got nothing. Nothing from there, okay. Warhound is going to be our scout. Our super heavy scout. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna have the Land Raider go down here, get inside of these trenches, use them as cover for the most part. Oh, we got contact from... there he is. Artillery down south. Artillery down south. He's gonna help... they're gonna help us take out that that orc, he's a veteran. Big shooter, a double big shooter and a power claw. That's going to be a big deal. Okay. Alright, Bane Blade. Or not Bane Blade, it's a Shadow Sword. He's going to go down south. Yeah, and so are you, Captain Tycho. And the Dreadnought. Along with our tactical squad. Then all these guys are going to go this direction, trying to take this out, and hopefully save these guys up here. So that is going to be a big deal. So what is that? That's six to eight. Uh...
Okay, can't do much to them. That'll do something. It practically kills them. Okay. You guys go there. You guys take their former position. And these guys move down here to help out. Same with you. Get in those trenches. Start putting shots into them wherever you can. Alright, that's it's working out. Reaver will come up behind, knock them out, then they can be re-diverted down south on along this road. This one can go up here, take out anything that's right around here or up here. That works. Okay, Marines. Take the crossing. Okay, land speeder will be our scout. Nothing up ahead. Doesn't look like it. A fair, fairly heavy force. Uh, yeah, support guys will move up as well. Okay, everybody's moved. We're fired. Yeah, hit them. Okay, well that's one unit down. They just gotta hold out for one more turn, and hopefully the Scout Titan can get there, along with some of our other forward units. But yeah, that looks good. Everybody's moved, so end turn. Oh yeah. Got artillery. Oh yeah. That yeah, looks bad. Oh. Yeah, it's a good thing we got Reavers coming up there. Come on, guys. Don't know where that was. Yep, lost them. There they go. They did some damage and took out one, I think, war bike or war buggy. There goes those guys. This was mech boys. Another mech boy unit. Okay, so that city in the south is gone now. There's Thraka. Okay, we just lost those guys. Don't even know what they were. I completely forgot. I think they were just normal infantry. Alright, well, Thrak is about ready to be surrounded by some very tough customers. Artillery. Alright, what do we got? I think that's it, yep. Okay, so, Reavers. Why don't you kill, or at least try and kill that? Oh, there you are. Gargants. One V2. Okay. Let's see how that goes. Hmm. Okay, Thrak is the major thing we need to worry about right now, so let's start softening him up. Take out his morale. Just, just hit him from afar. Oh, not close enough. There we go. Oh, yeah. See, this is what I love about the Imperial Guard. And I have no idea what that gun is, but it looks frickin' awesome. And there we go. Should kill him. There we go. Oh, Thrak is dead. <laughs> we just we've uh, we've created a time paradox because he's not dead in the cannon. 
Maybe it's like a, I don't know, like a clone or something. Who can tell? Okay, scout. Need you to move up. Okay, nothing there. Okay, nothing from the Warhound. Tactical squad moves up behind. Venerable Dreadnought. Captain Tycho. But we've seen where that Gargant is, so Shadow Sword forward. Okay, and we'll have the Vanquisher get up over there. Alright. Land Speeder. Okay, what do we got? Mega Dread with Kill Cannons. Grot Mega Tank. Alright. Nothing. I, I don't think there's anything we can't handle. Some multi Meltas. Maybe not that guy. These guys move up. They don't have anything on them. Uh, it could basically kill the mega tank. That would get rid of that. Still have the kill cannons though, which is a problem. I think this has better damage output. Eh, maybe. Yeah, we're gonna hit the Mega Tank. And the Multi Meltas. Yeah, we'll hit them. Okay, so. We're hitting around their side now. That's good. Nothing on the Hive Turret but these guys. <clears throat> so let's see here. Well, I think our best bet is to hit that and kill it. Hit those guys. And then get some replacements and try and weather this. Uh, yeah, get some replacements. You get some replacements. You move up. You move up. And hit them. Okay, that looks good. Hopefully we can kill that Gargant and then close off these guys and start pushing them down and push them into the Hive turret to try and hit them. Could work. Could work. Okay, move down here. Yeah, there we go. That also stopped them from getting across. Left to kill this guy to move in, I think. But everybody's now moved. But looking at the time, we are at the end of this episode. Uh, unfortunately, uh, it took us a long time in the beginning to try and uh, choose our units, but uh, I think that was the I think that was the correct course of action. Uh, but. I will see you in the next episode, so if you like this episode, please leave a comment down below, so hit that like button if you want to help support the channel. Uh, consider hitting that subscribe button, as well as taking a look at the description down below where I have a link to my Discord server and my Patreon campaign. Every little bit helps, if you have even a dollar, it truly, really does help the channel uh, in the long run. But I will see you in the next episode. Bye!